Yo, what is going on everyone? It's Chris here, and um, I'm back today, and this is actually going to be the second episode in the series of map breakdowns of MLG maps, and today we've got um, Warhawk, and if you haven't actually watched the previous episode of this series, which is actually the first episode, it was Freight, so make sure you go and check that out, the link will be in the description below. But anyway, let's get started. So we're over here in the main spawn, over here, um, there's a spawn here for Blitz, and this is the main spawn for the attacking team on Search and Destroy. Most teams, well, most teams anyway, go B, I know of, in um, competitive. It's probably the easiest way to go. But um, we'll start off with going A. There's some, there's actually a number of really, really good spots over A. Um, first off, there's these wooden fences over here. And it's really, really easy to kill people from over here. And just a little, tiny little gap between the fence. And you can see it right over there. And there's a spawn right near over there. Um, the opposing team, who's um, Federation, who's defending. So it's actually a really, really good spot, that. But make sure, make sure you don't get taken out um, because people with thermals and so on can really easily see you through the gap. Um, over here, if you're going to try and watch Blue Tarp, it's a really good spot. Um, you can just uh, sit there, and it's pretty obvious where that is. Um, alternatively, you could just lay prone over here, watch it, and then pop out as soon as you do that. Um, most people will have an enemy team, especially if you're playing 4v4, over at the tank over there. And um, what I tend to do is just jump over the Blue Tarp and just check to see if anyone's over there. Maybe call out if anyone's over there just to make sure and tell my teammates. Over here, you can blow this up here. I've already blown it up previously. Um, this is a really good well, it's a, well, it was a relatively good place um, if you're defending A or attacking A. The only problem is, is this glass over here. You can be seen, be seen through, and alternatively, you could actually see, you can actually be seen on the other side. So that's one of the only problems. Over here in American is probably the main building if you're going to be defending A. Um, it's one of the main buildings where action goes down or um, well, if you're going to A, then that obviously. Um, what I tend to do if I'm going to be um, defending A is either sit here in this corner and wait for people to come around, or I'm alternatively going to rush straight from the, uh, my spawn, just sprint straight down here, and literally just lay here, or well, lay prone, and just wait for someone to come around the corner. It's actually really, really easy to do. Or, if you're defending, just sit back here with an AR, and you can literally, oh, I'm wrong side of the tree, obviously, and just literally watch that, and wait for someone to come in, they're literally going to drop dead straight away, as soon as they go through there. Um, it's pretty obvious, over here, where, where you can plant the bomb, it's probably the best place over here to plant the bomb, because you can't really get wall banged as much when um, people are over there, because um, these metal barrels are there, and the wood actually is easily wall bangable, so I'd recommend not, like, standing there and, um, well, showing yourself to enemies who are over by the wooden fences over there. But anyway, let's go to Bomb Genas. Not much over here at Bomb Genas. Um, well, nothing really at all, to be honest. Um, let's go back up to the top Genas or top bakery, whatever you want to call it. Um, you can actually go... There's actually a really decent spot over here for holding mid. You can go up here. I'm pretty sure most people know of this. You can literally just hold mid. It's actually a decent spot for GBs if you lay prone here. You can watch all the way back of the ice cream over there. Or you can alternatively jump down to the green. I'm saying alternatively a lot on this video. I don't know why. But you can w jump down to the green tarp over here and watch A bomb. It's pretty good to pretty good position, I'd say. Um, but anyway, let's go to B because that's where the main well well main S and D gunfights go down. Or that's where most people go for B. Um, this is actually either ambulance or tin. Um, it's well we can get wall banged in here. Uh, usually at an oh, an enemy team has someone in that in that position. So sometimes it's worth wall banging. Um, but Definitely, where you want to wall bang if you're going to wall bang anyway, is over here at Water Tower because literally every single enemy team will have someone at Water Tower either defending from like here or they can also alternatively. Well, I'm saying alternatively again, <laughs> sit just straight straight under the blue tarp, or whatever you want to call it, um, here and just literally watch that. That's a really really good spot over there. But most people know about it now. But make sure you don't get caught out from sitting or someone coming from the gate because you can actually open the gate here. I'm pretty sure you all know that as well. And you can actually actually be seen just get shot from right in the side. But if you have got someone holding down the map, that shouldn't be a problem. But yeah. That's one of the main spots for defending B. One that, a good spot for attacking B actually is sitting under here and just looking in tin or ambulance. It's really good. You can just pop people off from there. People can't wall bang that pretty much, and it's really hard to be seen unless you unless they've got a thermal and you're not running in cog. Um, a good spot for holding the flank is right here. You can actually just literally hold the flank right here really easily. You can watch that. You can watch that. That's decent. You can also come here. Oh, is it here yet? Yeah. Uh, you can literally just watch it here. Um, lay here or. Or crouch here even and people can't really see you or won't expect you to be there and you'll just get taken out straight away if they come sprinting through there like if you're defending it another good spot for defending B is jumping up here and looking over here um, especially if you know they're going to be coming from over there on the flank or if they're coming through post people generally don't expect you from by, well going there I wouldn't really recommend that if, if you're like straight for spawn because people are going to shoot you plain and simple from the right hand side you've got no chance whatsoever 
Um, main map, or main part of the map now, the middle map, um, if you're playing Domination, I don't think Domination is actually on, that's not on the map rotor from MLG variant, I know for that for a fact, Blitz and SND is on this map, but um, literally this is a good spot, just jumping up there, I don't know if I've already shown this um, in this video, but that's a good spot there, um, having the car here is also a good spot, just holding down mid maybe, um, especially on Blitz if you want to hold down the middle of the map, sometimes it's worth running an AR over here, I'm not actually going to save my uh, Blitz or our blitz strategy for this map because it's absolutely amazing and I don't want any teams nicking it obviously um, yeah and obviously over the tank here you can see blue tarp really easily if anyone peeks themselves out over there it's pretty obvious just what to do shoot them or if they get away just continue wall banging blue tarp and they're pretty much guaranteed to die uh, anyway guys hope you enjoyed the video there's pretty much that's it of warhawk there's not a huge amount there's actually quite a lot but um, yeah I've done for it I'll go through it pretty quickly now and this is actually my second time running through the video um, Actually, this is the last spot over here. This is pretty much the last spot you can get. Just holding the flank. It's not too... Well, it's pretty obvious. But, um, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, comment, and say what you thought. Give us feedback on the video. And tell me what map I want or what you want to see next. Because that's the main important thing for this series. Um, make sure you follow us on Twitter. And make sure you follow us on Twitch. And we'll be live streaming all, like, pretty much all our GBs and so on. Um, yeah. Hope you enjoyed the video, guys. And I'll see you guys later. Peace.